ready. We are now officially airborne, peeps. Check it out. What's up, YouTube? <laughs> Welcome to another episode of Ark Survival Evolved. Thanks to all you guys' support on the other videos. If you like it, make sure you smash that thumbs up button, share it around if you like, and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. Um, cause this is a great series we got going on here, guys. So, so many crazy things going on. Um, this is the new base. We, we, we had the shell pretty much built uh, before, and now I have filled it in and done all the boring stuff. We got some storage over here. Um, tons and tons of storage. Um, but yeah, so... We, we lost Tina, as you can see, we have a level 139, Tina 3, um, making poop stacks over here, which we'll need that, because I'll show you guys, we got the, a little bit more of the farm stuff going on over here, so let's go ahead and pick these up, that one and that one, thank you, and we got some dodos to get some, uh, some egg action going on here, um, which we've got plenty of, man, we got poop towers all over the place, alright, and we'll do the... Oh, wow, yeah. Well, you couldn't make a poop tower, but you tried. You made a poop line. A poop fence, if you will. That's an A for effort. Um, dog. Dodos. I'm not naming the dodos. I really don't feel like there is. Dodos are dodos. They're egg machine. That's all they are. <laughs> so we got Tina back, and we also do have Rust, which is a cool little dialo I picked up the other day um, when I was getting some stuff going. We've had some crazy stuff. So I think in the last video, I mentioned that... Um, there was an alpha that was out and around. Uh, boy, there's so much stuff going on. All right, so alpha out and around. We'll show you over here, and I'll, I'll give you guys a tour of the base and show you what's what's going on with all that stuff. But um, basically, out and around, over in that direction, it kind of cuts back up, like up a hill. And there was an alpha, 55 alpha raptor over there. Well, the other night, whenever we were getting some stuff together. Um, uh, CXR wanted to um, come check out the base, so he hopped on his boat, went from the uh, the North uh, Tropical Island or North Island spawn, something like that. Um, it's up there. There's an actual spawn for it, but he's up on that island, so he took a boat all the way down. Uh, excuse me. So he took a boat all the way down, came checked out the place, and wasn't about five minutes or so until Alpha Raptor decided to show up right on that corner right there. Um, then pretty much locked us in this house for a while uh, because he was around the walls all over the place. It was crazy. It was literally like every bit of an hour. Um, I didn't have the stuff set up to record, so we didn't get any of that stuff on uh, on film, but uh, that stuff was crazy. So basically the same layout. We left this here. Um, we're going to get some more forges in here um, to get that going. Uh, we got ourselves a toolbox, smithy. That's good to go. We have random stick through foundation because everybody knows it wouldn't be a proper base without the uh, the, the random stick through the foundation. Um, over here we've got narcotics which we have crafting up which we have plenty of. That's perfect. Um, I've been trying to get tons and tons of um, Tons and tons of crystal because I'm trying to get the greenhouse going so that way we can get veggies going and uh, get some crazy yield out of those. But the fertilizer has been quite the uh, thing to keep up with. Um, I threw some on it last night. Which, out here, excuse me, is the spot. Which I've only got two, two of the veggies going right now. Um, just because we don't have enough fertilizer. Where, where's the door? Come on, door. All right. Yeah, so we gotta get enough to finish at the top here, which is another, I believe, four. One, two, three, four. Yep, so we need to make four more uh, sloped roofs and a door, and we'll be good there. I don't know, putting a door in over here, too, but that might be in the way of it, so I don't know. But let's go ahead and see if we can use some extra poop here. We can't, so we'll just throw it into a plot to save the timers on it. So we're also gonna need a Fiomia because those guys are a poop factory and that is going to be what we're going to need to keep up with this until we get dung beetle and all that kind of stuff going which that might be something to shoot for more early in the game um, than what I did last season and waited a, waited a bit on it so, oh day, daylight hello 
So, all right. So let's go ahead and see if we can get some of this um, greenhouse finished here. Um, I'll show you guys the rest of the building here. Um, we have our double doors. Ooh. And we have Dodo Egg Farm over here, which is really nice because since I built this big enough to keep uh, everybody inside, um, when the Alpha came and was basically sticking through the walls, everybody could get in the center enough that uh, we didn't have to worry about them hitting us. They eventually kind of went away, um, went down the beach. He took off to get out of here because um, he wasn't having <laughs> any more of that. So since we had the opportunity to go, we, we went. And uh, he went back to base and... The Alpha, I did go out and find him because I at least want to know where he was at. And he went around the beach, around that area, all the way over and is on that side again over there. So hopefully, you know, that'll put him a good distance away from us until we can get a little bit better built. Um, ooh, a blue drop. Um, get us a little bit better built to handle an Alpha Raptor, especially a 55 at that. So let's go ahead and drop off this crystal here and let's see that should be enough to get us what we need I'm actually give me back that metal pictures greenhouse Float. oh we can only make two huh I bet you we're running out of what are we running out of cementing face metal metal metal, metal. Alright, so I believe we have some metal stored up on here. So I guess let's go get some fuel for this. Pork powder. We'll probably go ahead and drop that. We don't need that for light anymore. And spark powder, spark powder, spark powder. There we go. Um, yeah, we'll just take one. We're going to try to be sparing the spark powder right now because stone is a. Uh, not a very, very common commodity around my area. I mean, I guess I can kind of go out for a little bit, but it's nothing close. So I've been using the um, the metal nodes as uh, stone gathering with the pickaxe. I'm, I'm sorry, not the pickaxe, but the uh, rigger hatchet. And what that's been doing is it's been giving me a good amount of like 80 or 90 stone per actual rock. And then I'm pulling like 30 metal off of it also. So I'm getting my stone and I'm far enough away from it that it respawns and right now it's working out pretty well just because we're within walking distance so I'm getting a crazy ton of metal and a um, decent amount of stone off of it so that's been working out pretty good let's go ahead and let's grab some cooked meat while we're here because we're gonna need let's actually get some water cook meat then water priorities so we'll take one of those and one of those Water, which I had to redo the irrigation system out here. Oh, I forgot about one more part I had to show you guys. So we'll show you this out here first. So redid the uh, irrigation. Let's see if we can jump over this. There we go. So now they're all running behind here, which allowed me to do five and then six and seven. So I've got 1,400 water to pull from, um, which is working out pretty pretty well. Um, over here, though, I had to run the pipe. Because uh, the tap would run right onto the part of the wall there, and that was just not going to happen. So we ran, we, I, ran the irrigation through right here. You can see it runs right through between the pieces of wood, which actually blended in perfect. Went straight through all the way over to here, which I have bought for paintbrush colors, stuff like that, dyes, and then cooking, and there is have to drink from right there so that's pretty cool because it blended right in I was afraid the piping was gonna look really really bad and it was gonna show and it, like I mean you can still see it but you didn't see it when we first came in here did you no you didn't so it looks great so excited about that we're moving up in the world we got some uh, technological advancements here um, we got ooh hello level 60 and we were getting really close um, okay so yeah, so there's all kinds of stuff wandering through here. Uh, we had a Rex pass through um, the other day I was on. I was getting a bunch of wood together. And yeah, we had 50 Rex just chilling, ran by right up front up here. And then uh, actually the same night as the Alpha Raptor incident. 
And he is getting right over here. I swear to God, I don't have to put you down, buddy, but that's my stuff. And we're gonna have so oh, wait. Connect, you you stop it, connect. Listening. Stop. There you go. Stop listening. Very good. The Xbox didn't listen. Oh wait, I shouldn't have said that. No! Stop listening. Alright. That is the joys of having a <laughs> connect. <laughs> but yeah, so you gotta be careful. Trigger words. Anywho, so I think what we're gonna do today um, is we're gonna not have enough. What did we run out of? Metal. Yes, we're waiting for metal. We have enough metal now? Tin metal? Is that enough metal? Metal, metal, metal. All we need is the more roofs. Roofs, roofs, greenhouse, sloped, greenhouse. We can make three. I'm just gonna get three going right now. We can always go there and place them. We're also gonna need a door, which is gonna be another three. All right, we're popping levels all day, almost to level 60. It's been crazy because all the crafting that I've been putting into, um, we're gonna pump fortitude because I'm tired of getting hot and cold. So. Make a door off of this. We'll get that going. Um, back on track. Um, so, as I was saying, which I do not remember. Ah, yes, level 59. So yeah, so leveling's been crazy because of of all the, of all the harvesting. Like it's ridiculous how much wood has gone into this, and there is no way I could do this in stone. I just don't have the amount of stone. I don't have the dinos to do it. So I'm thinking uh, cementing paste has been a pain to get um, another thing. So stone and cementing paste, two other things, and that's what's required to make a metal base. And I thought that with all the metal nodes as close as they are, building this base on a metal would be A, the uh, strongest way to keep it um, together, and B, something I haven't done before, it'd be something fun to do, you know, build out a metal, right? Or it's really expensive, and yeah, that cementing paste is going to be the mess. Um, unless we get beaver dams, which have crazy amounts of cementing paste, which might save us on that. So we have to keep saving up for that. Um, so I'm just trying to save up as much metal as I can. All right, so let's go ahead and how much is it for? It's 10 ingot. So uh, do we have 10 ingot yet? No, we do not. So let's go place these and by the time we get done, we will have an metal ingot, I bet you. Let's see. Let's go ahead and get this full 300% greenhouse in effect. It's crazy because, you know, at least having it covered, it was like 195. When I completed the uh, the whole edge there and without the door, um, it actually made it uh, 225. Let's just see for experimental per... per blah, 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 blah. For experimental mom, experimental Let's try this again. Hi, this is Stealth Fox here. Experimental purposes. Yes. So let's do it for that reason. And let's see if we get a gain at all. Let's see. Is this going to lock in right? Yep. Boom. All right. So when we close this, do we get an extra bump? No, we do not. So just having that foundation there or that wall there with the door, no door. Um, you get the bonus, I guess, already. So let's go ahead and pop that there. Does this gain a 300% bonus? No, that's 240, though. 225, 240. So I guess when you complete... I see, look at that. I hope I don't get, like, miss out on 300% because of this little gap here. Because it's something with, I think, the placement of this... Yeah, because see, that's right there, yeah. So we may have to rebuild some stuff, so that's not fun, but whatever. It's uh, because of Ark, you know? One of those things. So we got this here. Does he gain 300% now? No, still 240. I think we're going to have an issue with it. 255. All right, well, let's just keep putting these up. Zero percent, 270. 255. God, this is so weird. Why why is this one only at 255? 
Now it's at zero. What is going on? I don't know. That's so weird. These guys are getting 270 now with that. We just need one more. So let's go ahead and get ourselves the other last 10 ingot. And we may have to remake some roofing stuff. That's always exciting. The joys of building an ark, wouldn't you say? So, where are you? We don't. Yes, we want one of those. And it's really weird. The, you know, I had to figure out exactly, like, when it's saying left or right, is it from it left or right facing? Better not say obstructed. Wait, oh, I made it, but I left it in the smithy. Uh, fantastic work there. Let's try this again. Well, it looks like we have enough crystals, so as long as we get some more... Ooh, we're almost out of cementing paste, though. I think we do have a little bit more chitin left, so we can make a little bit more on the fly if we had to. But this should give us 300% uh, greenhouse effect. Um, okay, so we're closed up all the way. It's 285. Something's funky here. We're not getting the full effect. 285, 285, 285. I think it's because of that. That's crazy. That it's going to count that and take some percentage away. I'm glad it does because that's pretty cool that, you know, it works on those type, type of mechanics. But uh, rather frustrating here. So what we'll do is... Uh, I guess... We'll fix it later. I mean, I'm not worried about 15%. So it's, it's good to go. Complete a greenhouse. We'll fix it later. Check it out, peeps. It's a new, fantastic new thing. Oh, wait. Gotta watch out for that monkey. Gotta wait and watch out for the Gigantopithecus. And he'll punch us in the face. And I will end you. All right. So what we want to do is we want to get a flyer. I think we just need to get just any type of flyer. Just some type of flyer. It doesn't matter. We need a flyer. We've got some um, narcotics made up, so maybe what I'll do is I'll bring you guys back when we find one, and we'll wrap up the episode with a um, pteranodon tame. So, all right, guys, we will be right back. And we're back, guys, and we found ourselves a nice... 140 here. Oh god, it broke on. Didn't even hold him. Um. I don't. Ah, oh, I think we may have blown this one. Wow. Damn. The the bullet didn't even do anything to him. Um. All right. I guess let's um. Let's, let's fall around on the boat. We gotta we gotta try to shoot for this thing here. When he gets over land, we can load him in with some more arrows, and we'll just try to do it this way. Man. Bring back around here. That's it. Yeah. Still over the water. I don't know. Alright, so I guess what we'll do is, um... I don't know. I thought that bola would have worked and we would have been able to down him right there, but... Maybe we should have tried a second bola. I don't know. We'll just track him for a bit and, uh... We'll bring you guys back whenever, uh... Whenever we get this thing down or get it caught up to. Like, we're, we're gonna try to get this, though. We'll be right back, guys. And we're back, guys. All right, we just dropped him down. Hit him with the bola. It worked that time. Uh, looks like we're going to go ahead and take care of this Dilo here and get him eliminated out of here. And we're going to grab the kibble off. And it looks like we should be able to get this going. There it is, guys, the 140. Right, let's go ahead and get the kibble going here. Alrighty, 
right before dark. Hang the head on there, get some meat on them. And we'll go ahead and split these narcotics. Let's see. Hopefully this thing will get tamed up. Surprise, it actually didn't take too long. We just kind of let it run around and uh, jumped on it exactly whenever uh, whenever you went to go land. And the bola worked this time, so I guess they can fail uh, right off the bat, maybe? I don't know, that was really weird. But, um, but yeah, so we'll bring you guys back whenever we get this guy tamed up. Uh, we should have brought a saddle, but we'll just have him follow us back. It shouldn't be too big big of a deal. But, um, alright, we got ourselves a nice little flyer. Gonna have a kibble tamed up. We should be good to go, guys. We'll see you when we get back. And we're back. <laughs> alright, so as we're still sitting here, um, this guy is still taming up. Uh, it was just messing around, having some fun. We're gonna come back and um, tell you guys we're, st we're still going. This thing is taking up a lot of time. Um, yeah, so let's give him some more narcotics and hopefully we should be good to go. And we'll bring you guys back when he's fully up, ready to rock and roll, peeps. And we're back, guys. I was just wandering over here, checking the area out. Oh, wait, oh, there we go. land for me land level 208 nice very very nice all right so apparently we're gonna go all the way over here for some reason oh man got a little poopy so it is a purple gray and black it's pretty much the color scheme here um let's see we would have five kibble left um not too bad. Health at 1470. Stamina at 960. That's great to start out with. Uh, movement speed 136. Melee damage 406. So at least we'll do some damage with it. They're really not heavy hitters traditionally, but um, let's go ahead and head back to base. Um, get a saddle on her. Alright. Oop. Fail. Okay, let's see if we can actually drive without... Pterodactyl getting caught up on us. Yeah, looks like we're doing okay. Alright, so we should be good. Alright, so let's go ahead and grab one of our saddle box here. Our pteranodon saddle we made forever ago. We'll have to check the weight out too. I'd say at least probably about 300 weight would be ideal. We need to bring the weight up a little bit. That won't be too bad. We got some extra kibble left over for whatever else. And let's go ahead and throw the saddle on you, and we'll put it on. Alrighty. We are now officially airborne, peeps. Check it out. Nice. Okay, that makes a world of difference now. We're going to be able to get across the map so much easier. Uh, there was a purple drop. I wasn't crazy. We have to go check that out. We have to go for this. Alright, we got enough stamina that it's actually in a pretty nice way. Let's bring on the beach. And there's that alpha. Alright, we can do this. We can snatch this up. This will be a good way to end off uh, this episode. Here. Let's see if we can get in there, get this, and get out. Come on, let's get out. Come on, let's get the loot drop. Go, 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 go. Alright, so we got a scope attachment. That's not bad. I mean, it's not great. I figured they would throw like scope attachment, maybe something else, but you know, it's a purple drop, so you just know you're gonna get. There, there's the alpha guys that um that was messing with us. He's made his way pretty far down the base or down the base. You know, all white pteranodon. Check that out. Level 50. Not high enough for me, buddy. But yeah, so we know at least the alpha is a good ways away. Um, anything to push down that way so when we do get ready to, to fight them I think we're gonna go ahead and go ahead and beat up on them a little bit for, for stomping on our territory but this should bring us back bring us back to base here and we'll have to get an access panel for the roof oh wait whoa 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 so we got some speed definitely has speed
Whoa. Okay, well, that was weird. Now the joys of a uh, connect. We might have to, uh, yeah, have that not happen ever again. <laughs> so, all right, guys, I think that's where we're going to uh, leave it off at. We got ourselves a uh, a brand new pteranodon. Whoop whoop. There's a close up there. So there we go, guys. I want to appreciate. Uh, I want to appreciate. I appreciate. And I want to thank you guys for stopping by and hanging out and showing all your support. And if you like the video, make sure you smash that thumbs up button and subscribe if you haven't already. Because, I mean, check this stuff out. we got some great things to come. And, um, yeah, I'd love to have you guys here. Any and all support is greatly appreciated. It means the world to me, guys. So, um, we will catch you next time. And we'll see you on the next episode, guys. See ya.